हाय फ्रेंड्स तो इस समय मैं हूँ अलेक्जेंड्रिया और आप देख रहे हैं एक खूबसूरत नज़ारा अलेक्जेंड्रिया जो कि इजिप्ट का एक पोर्ट सिटी है और मेरे बिल्कुल पीछे ये है सिटाडल सामने दिख रही है आपको अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी जी हाँ अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी तो आज मैं जो बात करने वाला हूँ वो ये है इज इट रियली वर्थ कमिंग टू द अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी यूनिवर्सिटी को प्रेफर करना चाहिए या कायरो यूनिवर्सिटी को प्रेफर करना चाहिए दोस्तों आ, मैं अगर अपनी राय दूँ तो अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी मेरी प्रिफर्ड यूनिवर्सिटी है और अलेक्जेंड्रिया शहर मेरा पसंदीदा शहर उसके कई कारण हैं पहला कारण है यहाँ का मौसम यहाँ का कॉस्मोपॉलिटन कल्चर यहाँ की 30 प्रतिशत से ज़्यादा आबादी जो कि क्रिश्चियन है इसके अलावा यहाँ पर ये खूबसूरत समुद्र और अमूमन यहाँ पर जो टेम्परेचर रहता है वो 24 डिग्री से लेकर 30 डिग्री के बीच में रहता है और इस समय पे बहुत ठंडी हवाएं चल रही हैं एक अच्छा शहर एक अच्छी पढ़ाई के लिए ज़रूरी है लेकिन ये काफ़ी नहीं है अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी को मैं इसलिए भी प्रेफर करता हूँ क्योंकि यहाँ पर जो टीम का सपोर्ट मिलता है अलेक्जेंड्रिया की यूनिवर्सिटी पूरी एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन है मैनेजमेंट है फैकल्टीज हैं दे आर वेरी सपोर्टिव टू स्टूडेंट्स हर जगह पर मदद करते हैं कोशिश करते हैं कि स्टूडेंट्स को जो भी प्रॉब्लम आए उसको सॉर्ट आउट करें और एक पर्सनल ह्यूमन टच हमें यहाँ मिल पाता है गुड मॉर्निंग एंड आई वुड लाइक टू वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू फर्स्ट आई वेल अनाउंस अबाउट अलेक्जेंड्रिया फैकल्टी ऑफ मेडिसिन इट इज़ वन ऑफ द ओल्ड फैकल्टीज ऑफ मेडिसिन इन ईजिप्ट It was established in 1942. Uh, Alexandria Faculty of Medicine has four programs. One is the mainstream. Second is the international program, French program, and Manchester program. Uh, Students either join the mainstream. The mainstream uh, includes mainly Egyptian students, in addition to many international students from different nationalities, from Gulf students, from uh, Uh, far east from malaysian student from south sudanese and from indian students we already have many indian students in the mainstream uh, the study uh, for the mainstream is divided uh, in five years and plus two years for internship fair uh, the five years in the form of modules uh, or integrated teaching the two years for internship is not obligatory to be attended here in egypt it is optional the student can take these two years either here or in india or in england whatever he wants uh, also we make separate classes for the non arabic speaker or for the english speaker to make the way of communication easier for this uh, student for the international program also It follow also the same regulation and bylaws for the faculty of medicine uh, but it's differ from the national program or the mainstream program that it include small number of students uh, of alexandria university and at the end of study of the five years for the national or international program the student will get the bachelor degree from faculty of medicine also for the international program there is two years internship also it is optional not obligatory is uh, international students on the reverse include few number of the egyptian but large number of international students mainly from uh, gulf students and some from uh, malaysia also there is academic advisor for any students uh, there is uh, uh, employees responsible for each batch uh, there is uh, student affairs for the students and there is international office here for the international students in alexandria university either in the faculty or in the uh, administration of alexandria university to uh, help the student not only academic to uh, also but uh, social uh, also from the medical view health view uh, for activities Uh, we held many social and uh, sport activities for the international students to make them feel that they are feel in their countries okay and here by name i am the head of the international student office in alexandria university so i am responsible for all international students studying in alexandria university not only in faculty of medicine but under reverse there is only 
there is another international office here in Faculty of Medicine. Uh, also, there is, uh, there is another professor who are responsible for this uh, office here in Faculty of Medicine. Uh, the internship is two years. It is obligatory for the Egyptian students, but it is not obligatory for international students. This two internship is required for the release of medical license. So the country who will release the medical license for any student decide the duration and the place for this internship. So for Indian student, if the government or the medical council in India decide this to be one year, that's okay. Taken in here, taken in India, taken in England, that's okay. But this two years is obligatory only for Egyptian students because the license will be released from here for Egyptian students. But for the foreigner or for the international student, it is optional. Either the duration, the place is optional. You are welcome, all of you, and we are waiting for you to come here to enjoy your stay and your study in Alexandria faculty. Natural thing is that Alexandria University is the world ranking of the highest university. It was established in 1942 in Cairo, uh, Cairo University Extension. Ke roop mein. Alexandria established in 1942. Mein. और निरंतर यहां पर इंग्लिश मीडियम कोर्सेज चलाए जा रहे हैं तो यहां पर इंग्लिश में जो कोर्स होता है काफी सारे स्टूडेंट्स हमारे यहां ऑलरेडी पढ़ाई कर रहे हैं मेडिसिन की और काफी संतुष्ट हैं क्योंकि यहां का जो सबसे इंपॉर्टेंट यूएसपी है यहां पे अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी के कैंपस के अंदर स्कूल ऑफ फैकल्टी ऑफ मेडिसिन के अंदर एस्टैब्लिश हुए करीब 11 हॉस्पिटल सारे सुपर स्पेशलाइज्ड हॉस्पिटल हैं पीडियाट्रिक्स का ऑनकोलॉजी का गायनिक का सभी तरह के हॉस्पिटल्स यहां पर हैं तो यहां पर है करीब 11 हॉस्पिटल वो भी विदिन द कैंपस जिसमें करीब 4500 बेड्स हैं और जबरदस्त पेशेंट फ्लो है क्योंकि ये पूरा जो एरिया है इस पूरे एरिया से यहां पर पेशेंट्स इलाज के लिए आते हैं तो फ्रेंड्स इंपॉर्टेंट बात क्या है अब जिस तरीके से नेक्स्ट का एग्जाम सेटअप हो रहा है इसमें स्टूडेंट्स के लिए सबसे इंपॉर्टेंट चीज है कि उनको अच्छा क्लिनिकल एक्सपोजर मिले अगर उनको क्लिनिकल एक्सपोजर अच्छा मिलेगा तभी जाकर वो एक अच्छे डॉक्टर बन पाएंगे और क्लिनिकल एक्सपोजर अच्छा मिलने के लिए जरूरी है कि स्टूडेंट पेशेंट से एक्सपोज हो पाए वो यहां पर उनको ऑप्शन मिलता है अच्छा पेशेंट फ्लो हॉस्पिटल में है वो ऑप्शन यहां मिलता है करीब 4500 बेड का हॉस्पिटल यानी कि ह्यूज बड़े हॉस्पिटल्स 11 हॉस्पिटल सब इस सुपर स्पेशलिटी स्पेशलाइज्ड हॉस्पिटल गवर्नमेंट हॉस्पिटल तो एक आम से खास तक हर व्यक्ति यहां पर जब उसको स्पेशलाइज्ड हॉस्पिटल्स और डॉक्टर्स की जरूरत होती है तो यहां आते हैं मैं आपको मिलाना चाहूंगा कुछ स्पेशल प्रोग्राम्स यहां पर एक कोर्स होता है जिसको गेटवे टू यूके कहते हैं अगर कोई स्टूडेंट यूके में पढ़ाई करने तो ऑन एन एवरेज उसको जो कॉस्ट आती है एमबीबीएस कोर्स की वो डेढ़ से 2 करोड़ रुपए आती है उसके पहले उसको फाउंडेशन करना पड़ता है लेकिन यहां पर अगर आप ये कोर्स करना चाहते हैं मैनचेस्टर यूनिवर्सिटी यूके के एफिलिएशन में मैनचेस्टर यूनिवर्सिटी यूके का जॉइंट प्रोग्राम जो कि अलेक्जेंड्रिया यूनिवर्सिटी के साथ है वहां पर आप ये कोर्स बहुत ही नॉमिनल फीस में कर सकते हैं रजिस्ट्रेशन मैनचेस्टर यूनिवर्सिटी यूके में होगा आप इलेक्टिव कोर्सेज भी यूके से कर सकते हैं इंटर्नशिप यूके से कर सकते हैं इसके अलावा आप मैनचेस्टर के लिए पूरी तरीके से रेडी हैं यानी आपका जो कोर्स करिकुलम है प्रॉब्लम बेस्ड लर्निंग है पूरा यूरोपियन बेस्ड करिकुलम है एग्जाम्स फैकल्टीज ट्रेनिंग सब चीजें मैनचेस्टर यूनिवर्सिटी द्वारा होती है क्या कहते हैं यहां के डी बात करते हैं uh, thank you very much. Hello, hi. Uh, I'm Professor Dr. Ali. I'm the Dean of the Faculty of Medicine, University of Alexandria. Uh, it's such a pleasure uh, meeting you. Um, what I would like to say is that we are offering in our medical school a very unique program that is the joint program for awarding the bachelor degree in medicine and surgery between the University of Alexandria and University of Manchester. And it is a very unique and exceptional program because it is the only joint program between a medical uh, school in Egypt and a medical school in the United Kingdom. Um, the whole program is based on a curriculum that is exactly the same medical curriculum in Manchester University. The exams and the progression of the students from one year to the other is basically also according to their rules the exam 
The final exam is almost similar to the final medical exam in any medical school in United Kingdom and also in Manchester University. Of course, Manchester University is quite famous in the United Kingdom. It holds a very high ranking. Alexandria University also uh, holds a high ranking, but the Faculty of Medicine in particular have its own QS ranking that is very exceptional and among the, the leading 500 faculties of medicine in the whole planet Earth. The, the, the whole program is basically monitored very closely by the British, our British partner. They visit us like twice or thrice a year and they monitor the progression of teaching as well as the exams um, in order to be able to recognize that as a British program as well. At the end, students who are graduating from that, they will be offered a certificate that helps both the Manchester and uh, Alexandria University's logos, as well as the official signature of the head of both universities. Of course, the main advantage is that when you, uh, you are learning medicine in a, a UK uh, way, it will be very easy to pass their uh, test, their qualifying tests for working in United Kingdom. At the moment, there is a PLAP 1 and PLAP 2, but in the future, it probably will be the UK MLA, which is a Medical Licensing Assessment Exam. And that's a single uh, theoretical as well as also a practical exam. And it will be held for both uh, British national uh, students as well as international students. Uh, students who have been learning in Manchester uh, in our program would be very fit to pass this exam quite easily and and basically eventually to, to apply for jobs in, in UK. The program also uh, had the advantage of um, giving some choices for students to have some elective courses in UK as well as summer courses there as well and uh, basically it's also uh, awarding some uh, communication and uh, basically also access to the learning resources in Manchester University itself because at the beginning of a registration the students were registered in Manchester University through a certain process and by that by the end of that process he will have a username and a password that allows him to get into the uh, the learning resources in Manchester itself like the library the electronic library and some of the of the lectures in Manchester itself so it is quite a, a, a unique program. Uh, it took quite some time to have an agreement to do that. It is finally there. Uh, we are in the second year now. Uh, students from the first year are now in the second year. Uh, by the next year will be uh, a third year students as well. And that is the start of the clinical teaching in the universities. Uh, I do welcome and we do welcome uh, Indian students who are interested in having a high quality medical study uh, to come to Egypt, to come to Alexandria and, and basically be uh, um, one of our students or some of our international students. Thank you very much and we do welcome you.